here's another angelfish video. This is a uh, panda. I think they're just called panda angels. The white and black. That's a perspective. It's the smallest one in the tank. The bigger ones really don't pick on it. Um, it it's right behind it, so right behind the, the black and silver striped one. If you notice, the stomach is big. It was, when I got it, it had an internal parasite. It wasn't growing, it wasn't getting any bigger. I had to run meds through it twice. Um, I think I used General Cure twice, API General Cure. And it finally started putting uh, some weight on it, some size. It's, it was also razor thin, like sunken belly is what they I think they call it. But it took two treatments of uh, API General Cure. Um, I believe it's a male. It looks like a male, but who knows? And the koi looks like a female, but. Took two treatments API to get to get it up to this, get it back to health, good health. Now it's eating and its poop looks normal, and it'll eventually catch up to the other ones. What sucks is it had another one just like this that was a uh, female, and it died due to injury from one of these two. When they were spawning, they got a lot of control. It was scorched earth, and uh, they gave it an injury, and eventually died from the injury. Tried to save it, but there's only so much you can do. It sucked because it looked like the two of these were pairing up, and. Uh, I just got these two angels. I didn't think they were going to pair up, and they did. And they're prolific breeders. And, uh, tank's a little dirty, but. Yeah. API general cure, cure worked. You kind of have to look at certain angel fish are uh, very susceptible to the internal parasite, I don't know what it is, if it's just the breeding line or what, but, so when you're buying angels in a store, always look for fat, thick angels like these two, they don't look like they've ever missed a meal. Yeah, they get along great as long as they're not spawning. I'm on YouTube.